All right, welcome to the shop again. Tonight's project, or the next project, I don't know if I'll get it done tonight, is what's inside this big box on top of my table saw. And I'll give you a clue here. It's from uh, Win Environmental. And what this thing is, is a giant air filter. Let me walk you over to the uh, dust collector that I have over here that I bought from Harbor Freight a few years ago. Well, this big green behemoth in the corner of my shop back here. Basically, your, uh, your vacuum hose is attached there and all your particles, it's just a big giant blower. So all your sawdust and particles go through that tube there, go into this cylinder here, and they whip around a little bit, and then they, the big stuff falls out to the bottom. And uh, it comes with, when I bought it, with a white uh, bag, just like that one that's hanging up there. But I replaced that with just a, a garbage can and a garbage bag. Um, then I mount in there and it just gets full of wood chips and sawdust. But the top is actually the filter. But it's a real, it's not an efficient filter. So it, it pretty much blows all the, it collects the chips down there, but it blows the dust right through that filter bag into the shop and into my lungs. So doing some research, um, I found a company that makes a filter that you mount on the top of this thing. And uh, it helps with the efficiency of the blower system and it helps with uh, cutting down the dust in the shop. So basically, I just got to get rid of that white bag that hangs there and it mounts around the rim here with like a clamp. And uh, we're getting rid of that. We'll put a filter on top of that thing. And uh, hopefully that helps me out a little bit. There's a, another project that I want to do with this dust, dust collector, but right now that's all I'm going to do is put that filter on there. So get rid of the bag, put the filter on tonight, hopefully. Talk to you in a bit. All right, so I got this thing tore apart a little bit. I got that um, bottom off. There's the can over there. And I'll clean up a little bit of this. The bag's out of there. And like I said, that filter will fit on top. And then your, uh, your chip bag will fit below. And this is just a, what they call a single stage dust collector. Um, a dual stage um which is next on my list to build and i'll have to explain that in a later video when i do this but basically a, a dual stage will have um a, a collector for all the big stuff before it even gets to this and then uh it, it turns it into a cyclone it keeps your filter cleaner um, things like that. But anyway, so that's next on the list, but right now I want to put this filter in there and get my dust collector back working. So I'm going to clean up all this and take this uh, dust bag hanger off and then mount the filter. So talk to you in a bit. Well, there's the filter. This thing's gigantic. It's like 17 and a half across. I don't know. Two and a half feet up. I'll grab a tape line right here while holding this phone. Oh, two feet. So, 17 by 24. So, and the nice thing about these is that they're pleated, right? So that gives tons of surface area. Um, to filter the air so and hopefully that's less restrictive when it's clean for the blower motor so more power anyway keep going here all right so here's where we're at I got the filter mounted on top and it mounts with these, these uh, hose clamp type clips they clip onto the the mesh on the filter and then they send you some brackets. You just uh, drill a hole and put a screw in there and it does the same thing. Two little tabs mount in those holes. It comes with four of them. And uh, so you mount the filter like that. It just kind of pulls the filter down. 
and the filter's got a rubber uh, gasket around the bottom of it so it, it fits down in there and then they send you uh, two of these clear plastic bags and um, clear plastic is nice so you can see when your chips are full and these are they're pretty strong bags um, so they, they shouldn't rip or tear or anything like that but I'll show you um, what this thing looks like when it's when it's operational It's cranking pretty good. But what I don't like is that bag's exposed, um, you know, to getting banged around and stuff hitting it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this garbage can with another clear bag um, inside here. And I'll show you that in a second here, and, and that'll just protect it a little bit more. So give me a second. So just like that, turn it on again and see what that looks like in there. So something just like that. That's the first step of my uh, my new shop vac system. So once I get some more parts, I'll show you that the single stage system turning into a, uh, a two stage system. But that's my video for the night. Talk to you later.